All right. So, I've got uh, the thing up. Let me know when you get here. Oh, see it? Yeah. There it is. Yorker sounds. Sorry. <laughs> All right, so you're ready, and I'm ready. Let's roll. Falsetti's judgment. All right, let's see here. I kind of had to had to clear out a dodge pretty quickly last time. I had in-laws that, you know, had just watched me play for, like, two to three hours, impatiently going, what's going on? <laughs> Environmental crisis? A civilian oceanographic survey team has released a report that confirms the recent fears of environmental scientists. According to the report, the survey team has confirmed that the sea level is indeed rising, corroborating the accounts of many residents of coastal regions. Although their findings were inconclusive, the, the team did not deny that the rising sea levels could be related to the disappearing glaciers mentioned in earlier reports of the Crystal Sea. The team stresses that there will be no short-term environmental changes, but long-term possibilities include both flooding and damage to the fishing industry. The rising sea level could be related to the explosion on the Crystal Sea. Still, we cannot say for certain whether these are natural changes or a symptom of human interference. Whatever the cause, we will have to keep a very close watch on these environmental issues before they become a serious threat to our daily lives. Ah, man, this hall is so messy. Guess I'm alone. Well, I think I'm alone now. Oh, hey. Oh, hi. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Does that count as Japanese? I, I don't know. Good morning, Claude. We should stop calling you. Okay, have I already done all of this? Because, I mean, it sure looks like I've done all of this. But I hadn't. Yeah. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. I see, right? Welcome, Captain Wallace. <laughs> All right, let's see. Next is going to be 25070. Oh, wow. Snipers Ever level up and Lancers almost level up. Nicely done. My thoughts exactly. Done for I don't know. It echoes. Okay. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> All right. What? What? No. I'm no. There we go. the stuff that's equipped on people who are not in the field right now.
Okay. Yeah, that should be good. There. Once again, my cats confuse my scratching of my leg. Oh, he wants me here, huh? Oh, okay. I'm coming, don't worry. All right, let's see here. Squad stories. I think we did. But not this one. And not this one. Here we go. Honor, pride, yes. and regret. Honor, pride, and regret. I love squat stories so much. What's all that racket over there? Oh, those three are at it again. Lady Rebecca, what, pray tell, were you playing at? Why did you withhold Ragnate from your comrades? Could you not see their wounds? They were superficial oh, yes. and a waste of good <coughs> Ragnate. Those whiners just needed to rub some dirt in it. A waste, you say? What use is a medic who hoards medicine? I have my own ways of doing things. Besides, yes. people in glass houses shouldn't throw stones. What do you call a gunner who can't shoot a gun? Oh, shots fired. Always sneaking away from the rifle range to play with that sword of yours. Don't think I hadn't noticed. <laughs> it's no wonder your aim never improves. Wow. You're both full of it. We're soldiers. We can't just do whatever we damn well please. Rebecca, wow. that Ragnate is Federation property. You don't decide who gets first aid. You give yes, it. Yes, it is. And you, Florey. Do you even know what year it is? Only officers can carry swords. Ceremonial swords. How can either of you demand respect if you disrespect the rules? Let's talk this over and come to a solution. My solution is challenging you to a duel. Now see here. I'm not the one bringing a toy sword to a gunfight. A toy? Say that again. I dare you. Rebecca, Florey, and Mabel aren't getting along, huh? That's putting it lightly. They're at each other's throats. But if you ask me, it's simply a matter of getting to know each other better. They're good people. They just need a nudge in the right direction. Hmm. In that case... I've had to reassign sleeping quarters after some random personnel changes. Yeah. In other words, you're bunking <laughs> together now. All of us? We're very random. Okay, I'm, I'm broadcasting right now. <sighs> Doesn't matter to me. I can't help but feel that there's an ulterior motive here. Is there a reason for the reassignment, sir? Uh, nope. Like I said, uh, totally random. <clears throat> Incidentally, you're also being assigned to the same fire team tomorrow. That'll be all. Dismissed. Yep. So, Rebecca is an engineer who we have not had yet. Oh, that's enough sword practice for today. Hmm? Is that shutting I hear? What are you getting all snappy for? Maybe? She is in the reserves. Just, we haven't, we haven't used her. Right. I'm sure you can guess. Don't play dumb with me. You said Florey is completely useless, didn't you? Well, yeah. She can't shoot for shit. So Mabel is a sniper who I've used several times, and of course Florey is a uh, shock trooper I've used several times. Maybe so, but are you really a crack shot yourself? If you can do better, you should help her improve. Throwing insults behind her back doesn't help anyone. The only one being useless here is you. N now hold on. Oh, now see do here. you have some criticism for me? Let's hear it, Mr. Know-it-all. I'm right here. Fine, I'm sorry. Jeez, way to fly off the handle. Just let me off the hook, okay? 
Maple, were you just, how you say, sticking up for me? And you really let him have it. I've never seen you lose your composure like that. I come from a long line of proud soldiers. The Drake family tells it like it is. And I still haven't seen you at the shooting range. Why do you keep running off to play with blades? My father was a knight. An honorary title, of course, but he practiced swordsmanship every day. He was an honorable warrior, and I hope to be one too. That is why I follow the code of chivalry. Hmm. Knighthood means living and dying by the sword. Guns are for weaklings and cowards. <laughs> are you calling Federation soldiers weak and cowardly? No, that's not what I meant. I just... I can't give up my passion for something I don't care about. <laughs> Sorry for taking your time. Let's head back to the tent. Did she pass out already? Seems that way. But she's talking in her sleep. Oh, no, I'm... Please, I'm sorry. It's my fault. It's all my fault. No, no, no! Lady Rebecca, what's wrong? Wake up! Ah! You were having a nightmare. Are you feeling all right? It's nothing. Nothing but a bad dream. Carry on. Don't worry about it. You two should get some sleep. We have a mission to go on tomorrow. Have you given uh, Smokey his insulin shot yet? yet. Okay. to brief you on your mission yes squatty's task is to drive off the Imperial forces attacking the Federation fortress according to recon the enemy troops are a few in number but that's no reason to slack off victory enemy base is captured Failure, the enemy occupies your base camp or all allied falls in battles or any allied foot soldiers killed or 20 turns pass Oh, we have four. That will be all. Prepare to engage. I'm not calling you. I'm right. scratching my leg. I see twice as many Imperials as the report estimated. It's far too late to call off the mission now, sir. Good point. Sorry, everyone. This operation just took an unexpectedly dangerous turn. We're at war. Danger's about the one thing we can't expect. I'm fine. Doesn't change my job either way. You three are totally unfazed. Glad you're on my side. <laughs> right. Try not to get shot, girls. And if you do, don't come crying to me. How cool! Have you no compassion? Hush. You can nitpick each other after we win. And we will win. Advancing! There they are! There they are! Yep. These three should make excellent support for each other.
Commence operation. Would be cool. Would also be totally unlike the rest of this game. Give me more turns. Oh, God. Oh, crap. I expect the very best out of all of you. This is going to be hilarious. Oh, he didn't. She didn't actually fire. Fortunately, the armor we have Suck makes this totally unthreatening. Yep. Yes. We will eventually. Right, exactly. I mean, now. Yep. I approve. Do you have enough ammo? Got enemies here. Watch out for counterattack. Advance. I'll cut my way through. Fortress has been won. Here 
comes the pain. Eat lead. Hell yeah, this base is mine. Yep. Yes, exactly. Advance. We post. An honorable death. Kill confirmed. Yes. Can I go this way? No. Guess not. Believe in you. Enemy spotted. Take this. Ah. Well, I was concerned it would hit the little roof thing that it's got, and it did hit the little roof thing that it's got. For victory! So let's attack the left side. Let's break through their line! Where the hell did they go? You've been spotted. Watch out! I'm a Federation officer. I will not fall here! I see. That's how I'm supposed to win that. For victory! Yeah. I'm a Federation officer. Not I will close. not fall here. I have you! Oh my gosh. I don't know. Moving out. Let's break through their line. I have you. I'm a Federation officer. I will not fall here. Okay. Now advancing. Fine. Nice shot, guy. I hope the treads hold out. Yep. 
That's the last straw. Go get him, Mabel. I am a proud yes. soldier. <laughs> Next. Spines are overrated. Leave it to me. Yeah, she's just never in. Right. No reinforcements for the enemy. I said no reinforcements. We'll hold the enemy back. Take the wounded to the rear. That looks like it hurt. If you need to fall back, I can hold- You seem to be on your last leg yourself. I can cover you if you wish to withdraw. Do you take me for someone who turned tail and run over a scratch? I'd advise you not to insult the Drake family. Least of all, me. I'm sorry. That was out of line. I can never tell what's going to set you off, Mabel. Doesn't matter. I have no intention of falling back. We Drakes fight to the last. As do knights, the Imperials shall taste my blade. That's Mabel over there, and Flore. Why aren't they retreating? Right. Can somebody tell her that that's actually a sword, I mean, um, a gun? Wait, what is that? All right, let's see here. All set. Hang in there. Found them. Want to see something hilarious? <gasps> I told you it'd be funny. his end. Moving out. Everything's fine. Just do what you do best. 
Minerva's doing her charge in blindly thing. Officer, I will not fall here. That is fine. Leave it to me. I've got a clear shot at your head. The grenadier. One more for me. Kill confirmed. Not bad out there. <laughs> Let's do this. Yeah. Leave this one to me. <laughs> Everyone, do your best out there. Everyone, remember. To do your duty. <laughs> he said duty. A challenge met. I'll cut my way through. No, that's that's the wrong duty. No, no, stop laughing. Go get him, Kai. So at least Mabel can get a kill. Give me a report on the enemy's movement. They're firing on us. Ha! That's what you get. Take this dude out. Leave it to me. He did. Moving out. Ah, 
There. Didn't take much. Target destroyed. Very good. Yeah. <laughs> just watch. Minerva can just take this camp. She's got that long distance ability. Unable to fire. I re All according to plan. It was according to plan. Area clear. Mission complete. Mabel, Flore! Indeed. Are you alright? Of course, Commander. We are both. Uh. <gasps> Mabel! You're covered in blood! I was careless. Got clipped by a stray bullet. In my eye. Hang in there! Medic! We need Ragnade now! I'm sorry. Our supplies were all used up in the fight. Out of my way! I still have some Ragnade left. Help me patch her up! Right. right! Rebecca? I'm not gonna lose you. Not anyone. Never again. Don't you dare die on me. Okay. okay. Hey! should do it. You'll be right as rain in a couple days. I'm real grateful. Don't thank me. Thank Rebecca. You're right. Thanks, Rebecca. I'm only alive because you still had meds. Do you always keep extra for a rainy day? Hmm. <sighs> there was a time when you gave out Ragnade like candy, right? Another medic told me about it. You'd run to heal anyone who got so much as a scratch. <laughs> They'd all laugh and tell you not to baby them. Lady Rebecca used to be like that. Until one day, I blew through my Ragnade in minutes. That battle dragged on for hours. All I could do was watch my friends die one by one. Oh, that's not good. I hear their screams whenever I sleep, but I keep waking up. Yeah. Still alive. So every morning, I promise myself I won't lose anyone else. Maybe we should all be more careful with supplies. Supplies! Rebecca, you care about our squad mates' lives more than anyone here. I was wrong about you. As was I. Forgive me for calling you cruel. <sighs> I suppose I owe you an apology, too. You, I, I guess, can shoot or whatever, and you... Well, you're not as ugly as I said. I didn't mean to call your sword a toy. Wait, you said I was ugly? It's just frustrating, seeing how hard you work at everything but marksmanship. I only wanted you to take your rifle training seriously. I'm sorry for insulting you instead. A apology accepted. No, Lady Rebecca, please accept my own apology. My father was an honorable knight, you see. And that's why I follow the cult of chivalry, to live and die by the sword! O okay, I understand. I didn't know it meant so much to you. You did fight with honor and bravery back there. I'll give you that. Now please stop dying. But it doesn't change the fact that you'll never get permission to wield a blade in a combat zone. Listen, I say this because I care. If you don't improve your aim, you won't live by the sword. You'll die by it. At least beside it. <sighs> really don't. All you say means words. Nevertheless, you've given me a lot to think about. Do you mind if I sleep on it? No, don't sleep on your sword. Days later. You want me to help with your firearm training? 
Next you'll be telling me Portcavians can fly. So, does that mean you've come to a decision? Me. I think you won me over. We. He was yes. that relying on guns is weak and cowardly, but that isn't the case at all. A true knight uses the best tool for the task at hand. I couldn't agree more. Take our last mission. We all fought with honor and courage. Yes. It's not the weapons that matters, but how we use it. Suddenly, Final Fantasy VIII. Thus, I promise to devote myself to gunplay and swordplay. From now on, I shall take my marksmanship seriously. Glad to hear it. I'd be happy to help you make up for the practice you missed. That's all well and good, but remember, safety first. Don't go shooting yourself in the foot. Don't tell me what to do. I am a knight. Oh, but before we begin your training, this is for you, Flore. Stab. Karen stitched her torn holster back up for you. Try to take better care of it next time. I'll treat it like my sheath, Lady Rebecca. But why is there a teddy bear stitched onto it now? Uh, it's Monokuma. Uh, Karen said she made it cuter for you. Oh, she shouldn't have. <laughs> oh my god, so cute. <laughs> huh? Mabel, do you like this kind of thing? What? N no, of course not. I'm a proud soldier. I don't care about that cutesy stuff. And you can't prove otherwise. <laughs> um, I think Karen has some other patterns too. Oh, like bunnies and kittens. <gasps> really? Take care not to tell your uniform, Lady Mabel. <laughs> it's not like I do that on purpose. Enough of this. Your training begins now, Flore. We'll start with a mock battle. Just you and me. Uh, your name sounds silly and your accent's weird. Wait, what about target practice? I don't think that's how a mock battle works. Taking revenge? Don't be dramatic. We'll use non-lethal rounds. Though I have no intention of holding back. By non-lethal, I mean filled with pepper spray. Lady Rebecca, would you be so kind as to heal me? Should they need a rice? Nope, that's a waste of good ragnade. No healing for you. H have you no heart? Uh, I guess they've grown closer. Can't you tell? They're best friends forever now. <laughs> Hello, Zilnox. Welcome. Let's see, Florette is now a gun knight. Which I assume is positive. Yep, gun swords for the win. Okay, Mabel has a soft spot. Aim for the soft spot. So you just missed a uh, uh, time where everyone got together and we're friends now. Rebecca becomes a healer's heart. All right. Soldiers' preferences have changed. Personnel's updated. All right, let's see here. Let's head to head. Let's head to quarters. And let's trade out our folks. Okay. Yep. All right. So, ho 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 ho. There we go. As you wish. Claret. And standing Mabel. by. And of course, Rebecca was never there in the first place. You imagined her. She's imaginary. Right. All right. Um. Hmm. Uh. 
Let's see. Yes, exactly. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Um. Oh, is, is Jimmy the one who died? Yes. Ah. Poor Jimmy. Okay. So let's see here. Yeah, Lily. We have Teresa. Yep, we got Millennia, and then we got Simon, let's see, who else, Orion, right there, Vancy, <laughs> uh, she's so Vancy, we've got Voila, we've got Emmy, Giggle. Who else we got here? Britanny. Ah, Britannia. Sounds like a plan. Um, in the niche. I, I'll do my best. All right. And still, there are no engineers. <laughs> I'm trying to play the entire game without any engineers. And what's funny is I'm not actually. It's just working out that way. Um. I didn't mean to. Right. Let's see, Jimmy. Okay. Okay, where is... Where is Jimmy? There he is. Yes, yes, I... Yes, I know, I'm fully aware that I've killed Jimmy. Okay. Oh my gosh, you killed Jimmy. I was trying to find what was his actual, like, job. And he was a lancer was past tense I killed him okay I admit it it's not my fault all right um hmm. there <sighs> oh wait hold on before I before I run away shouldn't be any more news. We've got the mess. Guess well. Then he's alone. Shouldn't be anything in R and D, but I'm gonna check anyway because oh. I'm so freaking anal retentive. Maybe since like I took two steps to go, maybe it's now different. Alright, training field, which we've got 4,000 experience. Welcome it's not even enough to level up this one group I'm on. But I'm still gonna add it to the Lancers. Break that second wind. Ah, oh, I couldn't break anything. Right. Done for the. She's like, wow, that, that's it? I'm like, shut up! And yes. Okay, so I probably should not risk another mission, okay. just from a time standpoint, so probably we're going to end this. Right, Zilnox, exactly. Um... 
Yeah, because I mean, I, I, yeah, I don't think I have anything short. I just have Forsetti's Judgment, which I'm going to assume takes two to three hours, which I do not have that right now as far as time. So we'll just stop with a short episode, just one hour. Um, sorry, it's not actually coming in right at the end. So uh, thanks for uh, stopping by anyway. And uh, Noel, as always, thank you. And uh, we will uh, try to pick this up later this week. Um, they they are Maybe. predicting an apocalypse uh, Wednesday, so we'll we'll see if we actually get that. Um, Weather wise, I'm I'm doubtful. And uh, you know, um, this weekend uh, I'm going to be pretty busy. I may be able to do something Sunday. All right. All right. Later, Noel. Later, Zilnux. Have a good evening.